Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. My name Samsul and today I would like to share with you one topic destructive pedagogy in higher education landscape. So let's join me. As we know technology allowed for access to information constantly for social interaction and easily create and share digital content. In this setting, educator can leverage technology to create an engaging and personalized environment to meet the emerging educational need of this generation. The opportunity by technology should be reused to reimagine 21st century education by focusing on preparing students to be learner for life. In preparing 21st century learners, destructive in pedagogy is the main thing we need to focus. As Breguet 1997, when we recognize the diversity of learners in our classroom and provide for their diversity needs in our planning and instruction, we are actually differentiate the curriculum. The advancements of technology create change in learning and teaching process. Pedagogy not anymore about the way of teaching. The integration of technology encourage and evolve the way of teaching and learning. Pedagogy should be drive by the contextual process and supported with the technology. Individual diversity, diversity in needs, diversity in learning style, diversity of instructions, and many more is crucial. As educator, we should able to identify the solution to overcome the issue and challenges. Designing learning experience by the student, highlighting collaborations, or in the terms of sociability and fun. Student teaching action, interaction, and reaction is very important in the learning activity. Destructive pedagogy with technology is characterized by learner experience of motivation and engagement in higher order thinking activity with dialogue interaction with people and context. The student-centered learning shift traditional teacher-centric control of pedagogy knowledge and technology and confer control to learners. The response of learners to learning experience is significant as well as the intended learning outcome and the actual design perspective. The destructive in pedagogy involve learner behavior and experience, voluntary activity participation, higher order thinking and negotiation skills, sociability, learning enjoyment, and learning context. The destructive pedagogy also involves the BYOD, bring your own device, social media content sharing, social learning, personalizations, and the technology of advancement, for example, augmented reality, virtual and mixed reality, artificial intelligence, IoT, and many more. By knowing the destructive in pedagogy, as a educators, we need to create opportunity of success from accessibility to innovations. For learners, educators, and researchers, assessment as learning analytics is already starting to provide crucial insight into student progress. After 12 years, I conclude that four dimension in creating opportunity for students success through accessibility, engagement, experience, and the ultimate one is innovation of knowledge. This is a the graph of progression from accessibility, engagement, experience, and innovations. Level number one, learner get access through resources and material to assist their learning. Level number two, learner should be able to engage 
and bring the contextual learning in classroom. Level number three, provide learner with real mimic situation to enhance learning experience. Designing lesson that allow student to critically think, reflect and react into the situation. Level number four, the ultimate aims. From co-curator to explorator of knowledge, learner have the capability to self-regulate the knowledge, skills and value. They should have their own thought and wisdom. By knowing the destructive pedagogy in higher education, we as educators need to be ready. So with that, don't forget to subscribe and like my channel. So have a good day and thank you so much.